Hey there, so in this video, I'm going to show you how you can both market buy and sell on gate.io. This essentially means that you're either buying or selling a coin at current market value. Now, in order to do this, you'll first need to have the coins in your account to place these orders. If you don't already have the coins in your account, you can check out my other video in my gate.io playlist to see how you can deposit your coins into your account. But assuming that you've already got the coins in your account, we can proceed. Now, if you're watching this video, for the first time and don't already have a gate.io account, I'll leave a sign up link down below where you can save 30% on your trade fees. Having said that, let's get started. So right now I'm on the homepage of gate.io and to get to the trade dashboard, I will go over here to trade and then hover over spot and then I'm going to click on professional because I like how it looks compared to standard. There's no real difference between standard and professional other than the layout. You can just see see so much more on professional than you can on the standard layout. Don't think that you actually need to be a quote unquote professional to use this setting. So when I click on it, it'll bring up this trade dashboard here. The first thing that I'm going to want to do is select the coin that I'm interested in either market buying or selling. I will then go over here to the top corner and then click next to the magnifying glass. And I'm going to then type in the symbol of the coin that I'm interested in. I'm interested in safe pal. So I'll type an SFP because that's their ticker and then I'm going to click on it. So when I do, it'll now then bring us to the trade dashboard of SFP slash USDT, just as it says right here. One thing to note about gate.io is that they only have trade pairs against USDT. They don't have any trade pairs against any other stable coin. Before I show you how to place a market order, one thing I want to mention is that there's another way to place a market order on gate.io and that's with this time condition. If you go over here and you click on it, but in this video, I'm going to show it in another way. This way is a little bit more confusing for the time condition and I think most people would better understand it if I do it through a limit order. So that's something that I'm going to do. Now to place a market buy, what I'm going to do is I can see that it's on the buy tab and it's already on limit order. For the price box, all that I'm going to do over here is click the top number on the sell side up over here. And when I I do, it'll automatically put that number in here. All I care about is that this number here is higher than the market value number, which is this over here. This doesn't actually mean that I'm going to pay this price though, because it works on an order book system. Next, I'll either need to enter in the number of coins I'd like to purchase or the dollar amount of SFP. All you need to do is fill in one of these boxes over here and the other will automatically fill in. So for myself, I'm interested in buying 10 SFP. So I'll enter that in. And as you can see, the number has changed over here. Now, if I wanted to buy $20 worth of SFP, so 20, you'll see that the numbers over here change. So I'm going to go back and type in 10. And now I'm going to click on buy USDT to SFP. So if I click on this over here, it's then going to ask me if I'm okay with this. I like what I see and I will click on confirm order. And there you go. As you can see, I've just bought 10 SFP for the 1.74 as you just saw right there. Now to place a market sell order, I'm going to click on the sell tab first. So I'll click over here. Now I can see it's already on limit order. I'll then click on the bottom number on the buy side of the order book. When I do, it'll automatically fill the box in just like before. All I care about is that this number here is less than this number here. This doesn't actually mean that I'm going to get this price because again, it works on an order book system. Now I'm going to enter in an amount that I am interested in selling. So for myself, I'm going to sell the 10 SFP that I just bought. So I don't really need to do anything, but you can either type it in or again, you can enter in a dollar figure over here. So I will then click over here, SFP to USDT. And when I do, it'll give me a confirmation 
option am i okay with this now i like what i see and so i'm going to just click on confirm and there you go as you can see my sfp was just sold for 173 so there you have it that's how you can both market buy and sell on gate.io anyways i hope you enjoyed this video or found it educational and if you did please give it a thumbs up if you're interested in receiving notifications in my future videos then hit that subscribe button if you have any questions or comments feel free to leave them down below as i do check and respond if you think that there's someone who'll get some value out of this video please share it with them other than that thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next video bye for now